to GAS, Granger Avenue Studios. This is uh, the studio. Um, it's a mess. It's just got this uh, futon. I have some guests coming over um, that are going to stay. Um, piano. Um, and I've got this these crazy cables all over the place. Um, woo! Uh, mic covers, very professional mic covers. And they're going into my compressor and mic preamps over here. And then they're going into Pro Tools where I am recording my new old acoustic piano. So this is uh, my beautiful palace turned into a crazy messy uh, music studio. So I've got the uh, mic cables running through the living room running through here and I've got my piano cover taken off and this is the piano that Bob Hunsinger and his wife donated to me um, they wanted to get it to a musician out of their house and so voila here it is in my house thank you Hunsinger family and so I'm recording a CD for them to have um, in their house to have uh, this piano in audio format so I'm recording this, um, the, the piano. Here are the mic cables going all over the place. Here's my professional, it's my vocal booth, but I'm using it to stop the slap back from coming off against these, this wall. Anyways, when I get here, this, uh, my professional vocal booth is really, um, it's really a green screen uh, stand with a blanket. <laughs> um, and it's so professional. Anyways, um, here's the outside world. It's getting hot in Modesto. It's uh, almost July 1st. What is it, the 30th today? Anyways, here is uh, my new old piano. And um, I've got the headphones because I did some tracking um, on the piano. And I've got my Lawton Audio uh, 220, great mic. I use it for voice. I use it for just about everything. It's a great condenser microphone. And then I use one of the um, Rode M5s that Robbie and Darlene got me for my birthday a while ago, actually Christmas a while ago. I don't know, I, they got me an Amazon card and I went to Amazon and bought these two Rode M5s, which are killing. These are condenser microphones also. So I've got the uh, mic cables going, uh, running out of the living room, which is here, a beautiful living room. That's a bass guitar, that's my acoustic um, uh, nylon string classical guitar that I bought when I was in college in the 80s for 25 bucks at a yard sale and it still sounds great. It's probably way out of tune. Actually, it's not that bad. So um, I do play those a lot, actually. So anyways, this is now turned into a piano, acoustic piano studio, um, which I'm going to uh, take this all down. I figured I'd get some video of it for myself. Yep, but before I clean it up, I'm documenting. Bathroom, not that messy. And then kind of, yeah, messy studio. But I uh, love it. Doing a lot of work in here. I'm uh, doing some work, I have a couple of clients I'm doing mixing for, mastering for. And um, I'm getting ready for a gig on Saturday. I need to learn some tunes. Um, and then uh, here is the um, piano audio. And I did also some bass tracks. Let's see if I can zoom in, see if I know how to do that. And there's uh, Pro Tools and my speakers and um, my compressors are not on right now. Neither is the piano, but uh, very happy with the sound I got out of the piano. The piano sounds great. I uh, was kind of surprised at how really well the piano um, recorded and so I'm gonna burn some CDs <laughs>
thanks and in memoriam to their piano that they gave to me. So thank you very much, Hunsingers. Thank you, Robbie, for helping me with that, and Josh. Um, doing some recording with the Blue Bass. And uh, that's the uh, Granger Avenue studio for today, June 30th, 2023. Thank you.